If you meet Horatio and Marcellus, the rivals of my watch, bid them make haste. Think of him. Stan, who's there? Friends to this crowd! And lead you into the dame. Welcome, Horatio. Welcome. Good, Marcellus. Mm. Has this thing appeared again? I have seen nothing. Horatio says tis but a fantasy, and will not let belief take hold of him. Therefore I have entreated him along, that he may watch the minutes, that if this apparition should have come, he may approve our eyes and speak to it. Tush, tush. Twill not appears. <laughs> Sit down a while. <gasps> Break the off. Look again where it comes. In the same figure like King is dead. Thou art a scholar. Speak to it, Horatio. What art thou? That unsurpassed this time? Together with that fair and warlike form in which the majesty of buried Denmark did sometimes march? By heaven. I charge thee, speak! It is offended. See, it stalks away. Stay! Speak! Speak! By heaven, I charge thee, speak! It is gone and will enhance her. How now, Horatio? You tremble and look pale. Is not this suffering more than fantasy? Is it not like the king? As thou art to thyself, tis strange. Twice before. And jump this dead hour. By Marshal Stook, have he gone by our watch? In what particular thought to work, I know not, but in the gross scope of my opinion, this bodes some strange eruption to our state. Oh, yet if Hamlet, our dear brother's death, 